What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel for another episode of Game Night with Retro. So as you've seen from the title, we're getting down with some eSWAT for the Sega Genesis tonight. Yes. City Under Siege. So yeah, this is, um... So yeah, this is like a launch title, you know? For the, uh, Genesis. Uh, came out in 1990, right? So, I love those first generation Genesis games. We're gonna play it on easy, because I've never actually beat this game before. Okay, so I usually like attack, jump, select as my um, controllers, controls there, attack, jump, select, attack, jump, special, that's usually my uh, bread and butter. So, yeah, I've never beat this game, um, I've, I've had this game for a while, um, you know, it, it doesn't, from what I've seen, people just kind of like say, eh, it's okay, but nothing like that great. I actually kind of dig it. I mean, the graphics, to me, the graphics are pretty cool. Um, pretty decent music and sound effects. So, you know, I don't know. I, I'm going to say it might be slightly underrated i'm not like saying it's like a great game like a nine out of you know i'm not saying it should be like nine out of ten or anything like that but i mean i'm probably i'd probably rate it a six and a half or seven out of ten you know it's pretty decent but yeah you'll get into it i'm gonna attempt to beat this game tonight you know for the first time ever so if i do uh you know hopefully that'll be you know we'll um That'll be something that we, uh, a moment we shared together, right? There you go. So let's, uh, let's get to it. Man, that sounded like some classic arcade games there, like, like some Missile Command and all that stuff. Got jump shoot. So yeah, you you start out as just a cop here, you know. Just just a, are we supposed to go up here? I don't think we go down. Nope. We gotta go up. <laughs> So yeah, this is an arcade port, you know. I never played it in the arcades, uh, so my my only experience is is on the Genesis. Nice, took uh, took him out with one shot there.
time. Fighting a helicopter here, pretty cool. It's a futuristic. Futuristic looking chopper there. Of course this is in the future, I believe. not that big you only get four little s slots yeah that noise right there that sounds like some um, classic arcade like asteroids or what's that one that, like defender and that sort of thing so we're in a prison right now it's like a futuristic prison right Pretty big uh, that music, huh? <laughs> okay, so even though I was able to, well, what the heck? here and get my little ride thingy. So on your pistol here, you do have like unlimited ammo. Oh, wow. He must have had a freaking, some kind of phaser gun or something because that took me out. Killed me one shot.
but I need some life here. I only got one little sliver anyway. So yeah, the first two levels, you're just a cop in your regular uniform, right? But ooh, good thing I crouched there. Cool, I got a wave up there. I swear that sounds like Defender all day. <laughs> that, that, that sound effect. All right, so now we can we can fly. I'll pause it here. So now we got our um, robot suit, right? We can uh, we basically we're like the Rocketeer. We got a jetpack on a, on our back, and we can uh, fly around. Now we. Not unlimited though, because you can see at the top it says burner. That's that's like our fuel tank basically. So it's not unlimited flying. Now we have a bigger health bar too. So that's cool.
now we got a more powerful gun, okay? You can let it charge. get the controls down here. Okay, so, you, yeah, you can, um, yeah, your, your uh, fuel pack does recharge there, so, uh, okay, that's cool.
You just have to keep firing that thing will de de get destroyed. Dig the weapons out, huh? Missiles here. Continue here.
stuff kills you there, okay. Wow, that thing... Okay. You definitely got to use your jetpack here and avoid those surfaces. So your, uh, it's like your, uh, your uh, rocket, your jetpack gets uh, overheats, and you gotta let it cool down. That's how it um, replenishes there.
Jeez, that's... Man, that's, uh... Like, don't last long, does it? Your your jetpack. Okay, so the green is okay, it's just the flashing is where it hurts you. So where the heck are you supposed to go? Jump on these things. Gotta knock that down. Man, that freaking your rocket pack heats overheats quick. can't shoot up while you're hovering with your pack, so what what's the way to avoid that, I don't think.
Okay, I guess we gotta...
What's this thing? I've never been here before. I can't fire down. Some kind of drilling worm or something, huh? Just gotta wait for it to come up. Guess you gotta hit it in the head. Fire down like a concha, you know, jump, jump up, then press down and fire.
what's up? What's happening? Okay. <laughs> so I can get up there more. Yeah, when you're low, when you're low on your, um, when your rocket is overheated, you can only like hover, you can't like Propel yourself until it's in the red, it looks like. Yep. Whoa, okay. That, 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 that. enough there. Eh? this one. Maybe this is the right one. Okay. Yeah, the one transporter took you to the wrong, wrong area.
Crazy.
you're stuck. I guess I was causing damage. I didn't think I was. It's like he, he seemed like he was invincible or something. But hey, all right. Discover two shocking facts. First, Eye's leader was actually a robot. Second, he was trying to duplicate ice combat suits. Had he succeeded, Mission to destroy Wise I was successful. Once more, the world is safe, at least for now. Jason, another one off the checklist. Beat the game. Yeah, that fire weapon's pretty cool, ain't it? a RoboCop feel to it, you know, I mean, even though, you know, you're still yourself, you're still fully human, you're just in a suit, that's the only difference, you know, RoboCop was part man, part machine, we're just, we're all, we're still all man, but we just got the, a cool suit we can get in and out of. Oh, pretty sweet. push a button and it does anything. Alright, push start. Back to the title screen. There we go. East SWAT. Sydney under siege. So what do you guys think of this game? Pretty cool. I, I will admit there on the last couple stages I did uh, I did I did use a game genie code, right? Where it, it did uh, make you uh, not invincible, but almost. Like, you know, you, East, certain things would still hurt you. So, uh, I kind of like that where it's like, it, it doesn't make it totally a breeze. You know, you're still, you still gotta, you still gotta do things. Like that last stage, you, man, it's like you gotta figure out where to go. That one teleporting uh, device, well, basically I have something from, look like something from Star Trek, right? Beam me up, Scotty. It's like, yeah, I got beamed to the wrong place. So there's two different ones. You got to choose the right one. But yeah, pretty cool game. I enjoyed going through this, you know. Uh, for an early early uh, Sega Genesis game. I, I'm de I dig it. Let me, uh, let me know what you guys think of this game, you know. Have you ever seen it before? Have you played it? Um, have, you, have you ever beat it? Or did, did you, is it something you struggled with? Uh, let me know in the comments below, and I'll uh, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But I think that's going to do it for tonight's video. I put in a good night's work, I think. And, um, you know, maybe celebrate here with the Tatino. What? <laughs> yeah, got to love some Tatino's pizza, right? Hey, dig that music, right? Yeah, 
it's up, it's up beat, it's got a little, it's got, it's up, yeah, it's up beat, it's got a little spunk to it, you know, I dig that, it's got a decent pace. Yeah, they call Ice Combat Suits is what they call it, E-SWAT Trooper. Alright guys, I think that's going to do it for tonight, thanks once again for joining me, it's always a good time that, uh, that we have here together, you know. On uh, retro reviews, I enjoy. I always enjoy uh, interacting with you in the chat. So uh, yeah, I hope hopefully uh, you guys do as well. So leave me your comments. I'll get back to you. But if this is your first time to the channel, tap subscribe, then the bell, ding ding. That way you're notified when I upload new videos. So until next time, guys. Keep it retro.